Hello. So basically uh, what we are showing here, uh, we are showing the uh, smart home controller which is a completely modular device. It allows us to connect, uh, uh, to connect the complete home no matter what kind of devices we are using, a Z-Wave, Zigbee or uh, even Canix or some other Paradox or, or, or DSC system based devices. Uh, I will show you here how we can actually use the modularity of the device very easily. So this is basically the main unit, which speaks Z-Wave, but in case that you would like to speak also the Zigbee, what you can do is only attach the Zigbee module, so the, uh, the box is currently speaking both Zigbee and the Z-Wave. If you want to use the, Z the Zipper box for a security application, you can easily attach the battery module, which powers up the main unit for uh, up to 20 hours. Also, there is a backup power, a backup connection to the cloud, which is uh, provided through the 3G connection. If you want to attach the wired, hardwired based detectors, you can do that as well by using this model, which allows you to attach up to six wired sensors, two sirens, and uh, two PGM outputs directly to the Zippo box. And this one is a newcomer. This one allows you to uh, actually power up the whole, the whole composition, but also what is very important, to measure the electricity in order to save energy, like using those ampere clumps for the measuring the, the, the amperes in the, in the electricity circuits. Once you do all the management by configuring the device and connect uh, this device by connecting all other devices, you can go access to our cloud-based uh, uh, administrative user interface, which is basically di uh, divided into the three parts. One is the dashboard, which allows you to, to control and to configure all the devices in your home. You can use the climate air condition, uh, you can use the security panel, the, you can use the, the, the cloud-based NVR to see the IP cameras. You can manage all of your uh, energy consumption by taking a look and, uh, of the energy consumption of, uh, of uh, different kind of devices which you have. And this, the second part of the cloud is very import, important because it allows you to create your own home rules by using uh, various kind of, uh, uh, of uh, shapes and a simple to use drag and drop programming tool. For example, if I use, if I want to create the rule, which will, in case of the uh, uh, water leaking, do some, uh, turn on some siren, I will do it like this, and I will also add a message which I can send very easily by email, SMS, or even voice. If I am using voice, I can place the text here and the text-to-speech engine will actually speak to the person uh, uh, and transfer this message in, 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 a, uh, in a voice way. Also, what I can do easily, I can, I can use the if method to maybe uh, 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 put the condition on certain action, such as, for example, this one, which allowing me to set the RGB color of my color light like this one. The third very important part, which I can present as a I mean, third part of our uh, administrative user interface, is an API, which is completely open and interactive. So you can approach to, the, to, the, uh, to your box through the uh, fully REST application interface and see how to communicate with the server in order to create your own completely independent application. In order to find out um, more information about uh, Zipato, you can come to www.zipato.com. Thank you very much.